Welcome to Disc Tracks, my own little version of Rift Tracks. Our feature today is The Darkness, by Chance Wilkins, and let me tell you, the name is a total misnomer. This flick was obviously filmed in the daytime. Look for our quote-unquote protagonist to hit the hay while the sun shines bright outside. He might have said this to place in Alaska during the summer. You know, to explain the, the lack of darkness. He doesn't, so instead it looks like he's just on geriatric time. Something else you're bound to notice, the voice in his head is a little girl. Which, given his PDF proclivities, makes this a lot creepier than he'd intended. So, let's get into it. Jeez, Raxo, the audio sucks bad. Had to boost this five times to even hear you. What the hell indeed, Raxo? What was that nightmare? So, did you forget to film the nightmare, or are we supposed to imagine it in our heads? That's a relief. You'll need those hands later to masturbate. What's that thing? Don't know, man. You didn't show us anything but you spazzing out. Seems like a more appropriate name would have been the silence. Great, now I want to yawn. Whenever the guys had me released from the spirit box, it's not good. They didn't think I would release anything, but in all actuality, I did. Now whatever it is. Oh, man. So you opened a spirit box with your friends oh, off camera before the movie started? That might have been a cool scene. Too bad you didn't put it in your movie. <sighs> Just a regular day. Woke up wearing your clothes on the couch and now it's off to the bathroom. I don't know what that thing is that I heard last night. Whatever it is, that thing can't be good. We don't know what the thing is either. You didn't film anything. It's too dangerous. I choose to imagine Chance being haunted by Blind Billy. Whatever that thing is, it wants to kill me. Lots of people and things want to do that Raxy boy. so scared all i wanted to do was play with you what was that please come and play with me i'm so lonely you're not afraid of the dark are you Hello? oh run little girl you don't want to Anyone play there? with this guy he'll Hello? want to show you his disenchanted penis and see you naked i know i just heard something i don't know what it is but whatever it is it's not good you've mentioned that a couple of times we get it whatever is not good Stay out. Sure looks nice. I don't know, maybe I'll call the guys and see what's up. Yeah, call the guys. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Call the guys. Maybe get together. No need to worry about their names. <sighs> Yo. So they picked up the phone before you could put yours to your ear? Fast friend. 
Yeah, you want me to down my lake, or what do you want me to Which do? lake? Which lake, damn it? Yeah, I can do the lake. Which one? Yeah. Alright, see you there. See me where? Yeah, we're just ready to go. Yeah, I just got your hands on ready, so... Yeah. Alright, see you there. See me where? Hello? Hello? Not gonna lie, this is pretty boring so far. Nope. Yeah, we're ready to go. Where the hell is everyone? Not there, huh? Maybe you should have specified which lake. They said they were gonna be here. Crap, I wasn't going to be Finally, something believable. It's very easy to imagine Chance forgetting his phone. Kidding. He needs it in case he wants to take a picture or talk to a teenager. So there's no way the real Chance Wilkins would forget that. Wow. Look at this place. It's beautiful. Can we just take a moment to appreciate how much nothing there is here? The video is oh running God. at one and a half speed, yet just look at the lack of action. Kind of wonder if this footage was repurposed from another Raxi production ripping off the Blair Witch Project. Here in the forest, What's so that? deep. I offer you and turn us My meat bag finds this to be extremely funny, and I am inclined to agree. The thought Whoa. of Cyrax reacting like this to a child is quite humorous considering how we know Chance feels about little girls. The melodramatic tumbling was an especially law worthy touch. Yeah, no, there's no voice again. Actually, she stopped talking a couple dozen seconds ago. If you hear a voice now, it might be time to seek I mean, mental health treatment. Ha! Ah, listen to me. Might be time. Ah, oh, man, we know the time for you to get help was long, long ago. It's never too late. Unless you do something terrible to an innocent child. At that point, the window for meaningful help closes forever. I don't know the thing was. Whatever it is. It's not good. We get it. Whatever is not good. What the hell is with that little girl's voice? What's wrong with it? Unless. Aside from what she said about wanting to play with you, she sounded like a normal little girl. The question you should be asking it's yourself be is, why do I hear a little girl's voice? It's gotta be. There's Spoiler, no you're a creepo. I already left the house. Oh, oh, shit. Well, folks, that's gonna do it for part one. Let's call it act one. And to sum up, we saw a dude do a lot of talking to himself. Thanks for checking this out. Part two out soon.